know that plants are living and can respond to sunlight. Photoperiod is the period of time each day during which an organism receives illumination, that is simply the day length. The ability of plants to measure the length of photoperiods is known as photoperiodism. Flowering, seed germination, asexual reproduction and seed dormancy in plants are triggered by the photoperiod of a certain length. This specific photoperiod is called as the critical day length. Length of critical period varies between species and plants. Thus, we can classify plants based on their photoperiodism as long day plants which like to work for a long day, short day plants that like to wrap up their work quickly and take a long break and then as day neutral plants who are unaffected by their photoperiodism. As we know, long day plants like to work for a long day. So, when the daytime is more than the night time, we see flowering. But since they do not like big rest times, there is no flowering if the night time is more. However, if the long night time has a small period of productive time, that is a small light time in between, in this condition, the long day plants give flowers. This interruption of night with a flash of light is called as a night break. Short day plants want to wrap up their work quickly and take a rest. So, when the day is short and they have a big night time, they are very happy and they flower. But when the day is long and the night is short, they do not like it and they do not give flowers. Also, if their rest time is disturbed by light, they do not like it either and no flowering happens. Plants measure the photoperiod using phytochromes which are present in the leaves. These phytochromes act as photoreceptor of the photoperiodic stimulus. Phytochromes are dimers formed by two monomers. They are present in two forms which are photoreversible. Phytochromes are naturally synthesized in the PR form. When the PR form is exposed to red light, it is converted to the PFR form. This change can be reversed by the exposure to far red light. Thus, in response to the photoperiod, the leaves are capable of sending signals that regulate the flowering and seed germination. Exposure of the plants to red light or far red light leads to photoreversible of the phytochrome PR and PFR. The presence of PR or PFR determines flowering in long day plants and short day plants. When long day plants receive a flash of red light, they produce flowers, that is in the PFR form. However, when they are exposed to far red light, flowering is prevented. The exact opposite happens in case of short day plants. Red light, that is the PFR form, prevents flowering in short day plants, whereas far red light or PR form promotes flowering. A trick to remember this will be by remembering the company Leaf Research Foundation Private Limited. This means that long day plants in presence of red light will give flowers due to the PFR form. Now if we look at this arrangement from the bottom we can see P, F and R which will remind us of the PFR form. So by this we will remember that red light gives the PFR form which induces flowering in long day plants and far red light actually prevents flowering due to the P 
PR form. And the exact opposite to this happens in case of short day plans. So if we remember Leaf Research Foundation Private Limited, we will remember what happens in case of long day plans and in case of short day plans to the phytochromes. To summarize it, long day plants love to work during the day for long long hours and they hate long nights. However, if the long night is with a short productive break, they love that too. Short day plants are very lazy as we know and they want to rest all the time with no disturbance. To remember how phytochromes regulate flowering in plants, we have the Leaf Research Foundation Private Limited to take care of it. Also, to add on, blue light can induce opening of stomata and leaflets and it can also induce flowering in some long day plants. If this video was helpful, then please like this video, share it with your friends, subscribe to my channel and don't forget to leave us your valuable comments. Thank you.